Welcome back to the long exposure. Today we're going to be talking about using the viewfinder, okay? Now you'll see on a lot of cameras, and it's kind of sad that a lot of cameras, especially like some of these mirrorless ones or point issue cameras, have gotten rid of the viewfinder. <coughs> Excuse me. Now all they have is just that screen. And the screen is great, okay? And a lot, I, I, I must admit, I use the screen a lot. Okay? If I'm, for example, if I'm using, if I'm shooting sunsets, you know, or I want to kind of a preview of what it's going to look, I will use that screen to kind of get a preview of what my photos are going to look like after I've taken them, especially if it's like a longer exposure. But when I'm composing the shot, I will use the viewfinder almost every time. And this is why. It cuts out distractions, okay? When you're looking through the viewfinder, all you can see is what's in that frame, okay? Sometimes when you're using that, that little screen and you're looking at just the screen, you're distracted by other things in the background, the light's hidden in a little bit different way. You aren't actually seeing what's going to be shot completely because you're distracted a little bit. You look through that viewfinder, take that, that little bit more time to sacrifice that time, the dedication it takes to look through that viewfinder, and that in itself is going to help you take better pictures. It doesn't sound like that might sound a little bit quirky, but if you're willing to look through that viewfinder, and spend the time looking through that and composing it without any outside influences, you're gonna have better pictures. And I can guarantee you that if you start doing that, you're gonna see an improvement, okay? It also, I mean, like I said, the light also, for example, it's kind of a bright day. If I was taking pictures over here, you see my hand, right? You see how bright that is? I'm not gonna be able to see all the details in my photograph. Whereas if I have that right up to my eye, cut out that glare and that reflection, I'm gonna see that. It is okay to use that if you have to. For example, if you have to get way up high, you know, up in the air to get a picture, go ahead, yeah, tilt that screen down or you, or use it if you need to. But you're gonna give it better pictures using the viewfinder than you are the screen. That's just my advice. Make sure you guys check out the description down below for where I get my equipment. We'll talk to you guys later. Make sure you subscribe.